tried to end it. Oh, we tried to end it. After the time, I said I was with you. Please, I don't want anyone getting hurt, especially Rona. Well, you tried and failed. You can't even get that right. Oh, come on! Says the man who kept going back to Robert. Yeah, and look how that turned out, Paddy. You're risking your family and everything for her. Do you love her or something? I love Rona. So then why are you doing this? And if you say, I don't know, one more time, I'm going to punch you. Right, th this is going to sound pathetic. This is going to sound like some really sad midlife crisis, but she makes me feel good. It's exciting, and I feel ten years younger. Yeah, you're right, that does sound pathetic. Well, it'll be over soon. It won't last forever, and I don't want it to. And then I'll go back to my life once it's done. And what if this Tess doesn't want that? Well, she does. It's just her husband's away a lot, and I, th I think she feels really lonely. Oh, wow, she's married as well. You're both as bad as each other. You need to sort your head out, Paddy. And if you're not happy with Rona, then adopting a kid is the last thing you should be thinking about right Hang now. Hang on, who says she doesn't make me happy? She does. Very. That doesn't make any sense. If you love someone, you can't do that to them. Well, I do. I love her. And I love Leo. And, and adopting, that, that's going to make my family complete. And I want that more than anything. More than anything, Aaron. Please, yeah, you have to believe me. Well, I don't. Not anymore. Aaron, please. Th th Get out. Fine. Whatever you want, but I have to be able to trust you not to say anything to Rona. You shouldn't even have to ask me that. I don't betray people. It's a shame I can't say the same about you, though, innit? Well, I was wondering where you got to. I'm chatting to her. Boys, I don't know what you find to talk about. You feeling okay? You need a hand? I'm fine. You look tired. Thanks. Oh. Oh, hey, how was the meeting? Good, yeah, although uh, I think Rita was flirting with me. <laughs> I bet she wasn't. Well, you weren't there. I can be pretty magnetic. You didn't flirt too much, did you? Only I don't want you coming across as creepy. Well, now you're here. Can you take over from Dan behind the bar? Yeah, she needs me too. I don't. Go and do your thing in the kitchen. Yes, boss. You shouldn't be working while you're having trouble. I'm not going to put my life on hold for the next few months. Well, unless you can put your feet up once you've sold the place. You had anyone round? Oh, I see what this is. You're angling for me to take you up on your offer. Well, it'll save you a lot of stress. And put a pile on to Chaz. Suit yourself. Uh, can you can I get another pint that's got hair in it? Sorry, I... You are so insensitive. What? Diane's having chemo and you're going on about how tired she looks. Yeah, because I'm worried about her. Yeah, well, she says she's fine to work. Just back off. She knows how she feels more than you do. Hi. You all right? Yeah. Actually, can I have a word? Yeah. <sighs> Can't shut you up once you get started. Do you know what? Just forget it. Aaron. Anything you tell me is in confidence, you know. Right. It's just, um... You know I told you about my mum walking out when I was younger? Yeah. And that's kind of where it all went wrong. Well, my dad, he, he blamed me. And I just don't, I don't want that happening to another kid. Not that Paddy and Rona are anything like him, it's just... If they split up, then that kid's gonna suffer. Are you saying that they're going to? Only, that's not what I've heard from anyone else. I don't know, probably not, it's just... You know, these, these things happen and then... Look, Aaron, it's vitally important that these children go to a stable home. If you don't think that Paddy and Rona can provide that, it's your duty to tell me. I think they're having problems. Marriage problems, and... I don't know if they're going to stay together. Hey, thanks for... Thanks for being honest. I've asked her to call in on the way back to the office, you know, give us a little bit of feedback. Well, I told her you were the best. Obvs. I was honest. 
I don't get drunk with my best mate nearly enough. How is that relevant? Well, it's not, but I'm just putting it out there. Look, stop worrying. We made sure she knew you're both A's, didn't we? I don't know what I said. I was too busy fighting her off. Hmm, and I'm pretty sure Pearl stuck to the script as well. Yeah, I hope so. Oh, just relax. We all totally came through for you. I'm sure of it. I knew I could rely on you a lot. Is uh, Diane in the back? Uh, no, she's gone to see Chrissy at the salon. <laughs>